So, the latest update in the Arsenal circus. Kieran Gibbs is officially a West Bromwich Albion player. <laughs> Finally, we have shipped this guy out of our club. He's been living the dream for too long. Um, I personally jinxed the deal because I said he was going to Watford a couple of days ago. Um, pretty similar to when I jinxed the Debuchy to Nice deal as well. He was en route to Nice and that all went tits as well. So... I thought I'd hang fire on the West Brom one until he was actually pictured in a shirt or holding a shirt up at West Brom, which he now is. Um, obviously, West Brom have stumped up what he wanted personally in his pay packet. Like I said, I find it quite strange that Watford were in for him and he didn't want to stay local to where he is. He wouldn't have to relocate, he wouldn't have to, wouldn't have to move. He could stay living near his family, all his family are from the same area. And it'd still be close to all his mates because obviously he's, he's an, an ex-Arsenal player now. So obviously all of his mates are right next door because our training grounds are 200 yards apart. Um, so yeah, I did find it a little bit strange, but apparently he rejected a 45 grand a week offer from Watford. He was demanding closer to 60,000, which obviously West Brom have, have stumped up or close to. So yeah, fair play. He's obviously nicked another 15 grand out of West Brom that he wouldn't have got out of Watford. So, fair play to him, but I'm just happy he's left, to be honest with you. Um, in other news, unless you've been living on the moon for the last 12 hours, Man City bid £50 million for Alexis Sanchez last night. Um, that was swiftly rejected, but we ain't at the end of this yet. There's less than 36 hours of this window to go. They are definitely coming back in with another bid. Um, my thoughts on Sterling coming in the opposite direction? Nah. Nah, 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 nah. Not for me. We've already got way too many quick, midget, small, lightweight players um, that, can, that can run far. I don't want none of that. I don't want none of that. No thanks. Raheem Sterling is not good enough for Arsenal. He's not good enough for Man City. They were mad to spend £50 million on him and Liverpool rightly had their pants down on that one. But... We ain't heard the end of the Alexis Sanchez one. That's going to rumble on all the way to the, the last minutes of deadline day, in my opinion. But sadly, I do think he is going to leave. I think we're going to buckle and we're going to take the money. So as soon as that gets up close to £60 million, it'll be hard to reject £60 million when he's only got 11 months left on a contract. So um, in other news as well, like I said, again, unless you've been living on the moon, Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain, we agreed a fee with Chelsea of close to £40 million, pounds. he's actually rejected Chelsea, which, <laughs> wow, you know, if, if I was him and I was in his position, I'd be looking at Chelsea thinking I've got more chance of winning the title at Chelsea than I have at Liverpool, which he, he clearly wants to go to. Um, with Liverpool, they haven't actually submitted a bid as far as I'm aware. Um, they asked about him last week and Arsenal quoted him £40 million and one pound. how ironic. <laughs> so, yeah, another one that's that's going to rumble on. Um, the reason he turned Chelsea down is apparently Conte said to him that he'd be playing right wing back. He doesn't want to play right wing back. He wants to play centre midfield. Conte told him he would not be getting a centre midfield role at Chelsea. So, he wants Liverpool. Um, I believe his missus lives up north somewhere, Newcastle perhaps. I might be wrong on that. But, yeah, that's going to drag on and on and on. And as it stands... Banter FC is currently in a profit for this transfer window now Gibbs is officially gone. Anyway, leave your comments down there. One last thing I want to say as well is thanks very much to every single person who enjoyed, agreed, commented, liked and shared the Wenger out rant I did. I felt better getting that off my chest. That was just such a release saying what I said in that video. And I'm overwhelmed with the amount of people that have, that have subscribed to the channel since as well. I've had about 800 people subscribe to the channel, so I appreciate every single person who has. Um, and it is now officially my most watched video. It's over 21,000 views now, so appreciate that. This channel's only been going four months, and like I say, I'm overwhelmed with how quick this is growing. So thanks very much. All have a great day. 
I'm sure I'll see you later on at some point. Laters, peeps. Mm -hmm.